to my channel, it's your girl GD, and if it's your first time stopping by, you're welcome to this channel. So today I'm going to serve you this look, this is like a simple, easy, quarantine fine, summertime fine look, like it's just basically one eyeshadow and like lip gloss and the whole face beats. So if you want to see how I created this look, then keep on watching. Okay, so before we get into this sleigh, I wanted to do a little bit of hair. I hardly do hair on my channel. I said, you know what, let me show you guys how I lay my edges. So yeah, I look crazy right now, but wait for the magic. So I'm not very good at doing my edges, so don't come for me in the comments, okay? Be nice, okay? So um, I just like put some hair wax and like just do like the little swoops, but I think it looks good. Oh, don't you guys think so? It's like... Okay, let's get into this sleigh. I'm moisturizing my face today with my favorite moisturizer, which is this one from Mismetic. I really, really, really love it. And then I'm going to go in with my Mario Badosco spray. I know I said my face is dry, but I have oily combination skin, so I have to also prep and prime with this primer from Zara. And this is like the oil block primer. It's really good. It helps make your makeup last so long. Now for foundation, Fenty Beauty is my jam for today. <laughs> And I know I said I only use beauty blenders right now, but I don't know. I was feeling like using a brush today, and I love the way it blended in my foundation. Like, can you guys see this coverage? Also, this is a Sigma Beauty brush. I would leave all the details down below. If you want to see, you should try and coop some. I have a discount code. You can check it out if you want, you know, saving you some coin. all that blending now we can move into contour i'm using the black opal stick foundation in the shade carob to chisel out my face okay because i'm looking kind of big quarantine weight okay don't come for me <laughs> so now to blend out that contour you really want to like you want to see your contour but you don't want it to be shouting do you guys want me to do like an in-depth tutorial on how i do my contour and highlight i feel like i always brush through this step and everything because I feel like everybody knows how to contour and highlight your face if you guys want to see a video leave a comment down below and I'll be sure to make a video for you especially on how to contour and highlight but basically you just need to take your time okay so now for highlighting I'm using a combination of Zika Cosmetics Honey and also my LA Girl Corrector in the shade yellow gonna blend in after all that layering with a beauty blender like the actual beauty blender I'm gonna use that to blend in my concealer and I really like how this sponge did like to be honest I really do like it So after blending in your concealer, you want your face to look like this, okay? So I'm not gonna lie, I was really feeling myself. I like how my contour highlight was looking this day. My base was looking set, but now to set my face. Okay, actual setting with the Laura Mercier setting powder. You guys already know this drill, I do it in all my videos, but yeah. I lost like majority of the footage and how I was doing my brows. So if you guys want a video, let me know and I'll make one specially for you. So finally for my eyes, I'm taking my Huda Beauty Warm Obsessions palette and I used the orangey peach shade on my lid. Um, so I just applied the majority of the products on my lid and I just like buffed it out, like spread it out. I, I don't want to say spread, like I was really light but still it showed but it was kind of light. So now taking my favorite, favorite lashes, and this is from Wink Lashes. This is in the style Beauty Fight. I'm just gonna pop that on my lash line, okay. So now for my lips, I'm just using a regular brown lipstick. And this one's from Zika Cosmetics, and I'm just gonna use that to outline my lips because I prefer to do it use this instead of like a lip pencil. I don't know why, but like mostly pencils don't give as much coverage. 
as the lipsticks do i don't know why but for me personally that's what i noticed so i like to use a liquid lipstick and i'm just going in with another color it's like a nude color a nude brownish color and i really like the combination i got this day to be honest To top that off, I'm going in with a nude gloss and I think this was from the Kim Kardashian x Chloe collection. Doing my happy dance because it's my favorite part. Highlighter. I'm going in with my Too Faced highlighter in the shade Fancy Pink Diamond. So to make my highlight pop a little bit, I went in with my Zikel highlighter. Uh, this is the Honey Dust highlighter and I just put that on top of the Too Faced one and it was just a perfect combination. I wanted my lips to look more juicy so I went in with some clear gloss. This is just like absolute clear gloss, don't come for me. And that is it guys. This Tell me this is not serving you summertime, fine girl, quarantine buddy vibes like okay guys that completes this look thank you guys so much for watching up to this point if you liked this look don't forget to give it a thumbs up watch my other videos um come back to this channel turn on the post notification so you don't get to miss any video i upload on my channel and i'll be sure to make more videos for you guys stay safe guys bye